Hi guys, welcome to Truthfully Toyosi. So let's watch this video step by step to see how Toyosi brought my character to life. Enjoy. So first things first, we're going to be using these three softwares. We're going to be using Canva to create a design, ChatGBT to create the avatar itself, and Eleven Labs for voice. So the first place we're heading to is ChatGPT to create our avatar. So I'm going to click on ChatGPT now and uh yes so we're going to click on it and it's going to open up the software so chat gpt is an ai software where you can impute um some text to create um the avatar so we're going to reason chat gpt for but usually for a, a newcomer that has not used chat gpt before if you open it it's going to take you to chat gpt 3.5 first of all but we need chat gpt 4 to be able to assess that e ultra software because that's the software we're going to be using to create the avatar so put it on chat, chat gpt 4 and click on dial 3 ultra so it brings us here where we're going to input our prompt so it can create the avatar I'm going to put a prompt in the description below. So if you want to use the prompt or edit it, you can always have access to it to be in the description. So here's my prompt imputed already. Uh, let's scroll through and see anything to change. I don't think we need to edit anything. So we're just going to go over and click on generate. So it's generating the image already. So give it a few seconds and you have your image ready. Um, okay, so, okay, it's, gener it's generated an image already. I don't really like this one. So, although it's nice, but this is really not what I want. So, I'm just going to uh, reload it. So, it will generate another image using the same prompt. I don't even have to change it, just reload. Let's see what it brings this time around. Okay. Uh, okay, this is not bad. I really like this one. I think we're we'll using this one. So what I'm going to do now is I'm just going to click on the download arrow down there, up there at that. So we'll just wait for it to download completely. I really like this image because it captures what I have in mind. And uh, I don't think there's anything I would change here. So I think this is good enough. Usually I do this two or three times so I can get multiple images. So I can um, choose the one I really want to use. So the next thing we're going to be doing is we'll head over to canva.com. We're going to use Canva to um, resize the image and then um, put it all together. So Canva is like the glue that will hold the whole of our image together. So here we are. We're going to type YouTube, YouTube video. So that will just help us resize it to the size you need for a YouTube video. So type YouTube video, click enter, and then it's going to show us a blank canvas. So we'll just pick that. Yes, create a blank YouTube video. We'll click on that. So we're in here already. So if you look to the left, you can see some bars on the left. So pay attention to that part because we're going to be using it a lot. So we're going to go to upload here. We already have our avatar downloaded, but we need to upload it on Canva. So we'll click on upload files. You can see that I have some pictures here already, but let's use the one we just um, upload. We just downloaded. So we'll click upload and uh, I already have the file and I'll just upload it. So this is it. I'll click on the file here. So it's already on our Canva. So we'll just resize it now. So fill it into the Canva and I think we're good to go. It's perfect now. So what we're going to do is we're going to save this image. So our image has been resized. Let's zoom in and look at the picture a lot better. Okay, this is really pretty. I like this um, avatar. So let's save it. We'll just click on share. And uh, remember, we want to save it as a picture. So we're going to be resizing it as a picture. So we'll click on um, the place where it's written MP4 and convert it to PNG. We're going to leave it at the size at which it is right now and click on download. So that's about it. And I think we are done with Canva for now.
right yes so we just click on download and um, it's downloading and download is complete so we're done with this part the next place we are heading to is uh, DID Creative Reality Studio. So what we're going to be doing here is we're going to upload our already resized photo here. So once we upload it here, we can go back to Canva and uh, put everything together. So we'll click on this DID Creative Reality Studio. Let's click on it. It takes us to this page. You can start now for free or you can log in. For me, I already um, have an account, so I'll just log in. We'll look to the right. You see the login icon, and I'm just going to log in. So this is what it looks like. If you look at it very well, you see that I have some um, pictures there already. But we're just going to upload the one we just resized and downloaded. So click on Create Video. Click on Create Video. Allow it to load. Then go down and click on Add. We'll click on add because that's where we're going to be um, uploading the picture from so once you click on add it will tell you some criteria um, that is needed for your video to be uploaded so it must be a medium shot um, with a neutral facial expression and a closed mouth the picture must have a minimal head size um, and all of that so we're just going to upload our image okay yeah it's uploaded already let's see yes okay this is the image let's look at it very well do we need to zoom in i don't think so so we don't need to do anything else here we'll just head head back to canva remember um we are we stopped here on canva so what we're going to do on canva now is we're going to delete this image because we don't need it again just click on the image and you can see the delete button so we'll delete it now we'll go back to the left bar remember i said we're going to be using this left bar a lot so scroll down you see did ai presenter so this is the same did software just embedded in canva so if you can't find it there just come over here and type it out and then click on it so if you click on it, it will allow it to load first so here we are i'm already logged into my um did um app on canva so all my um uploaded pictures are here so if you're not logged in just scroll down to the last page you'll see um an icon where it says you should log in then you just log in then whatever image you've uploaded earlier you find it here so i'm going to click on the image now once I click on the image, it's not going to show on the black canvas because what this is trying to do is going to try and merge the image with, with your voice recording so you can have your avatar talking. So we'll click on upload audio, but first we don't have a voice recording or we don't have any recorded audio. So what we're going to do now is, so we're going to head over to 11 labs. So this is where we're going to get our audio. Um, we'll click on 11 labs and then we'll click on 11 labs AI generator. So this is a very good audio, um, AI generator because you can change the voice to a male, a female. You can change it to an American accent, a British accent, whatever accent you want. So we'll click on text to speech. I'm just going to impute the text for, um, the voice recording I want. So I think this is good. I don't need to change anything. Um, next thing I'm going to do, I'm just going to scroll down and click on generate. So it's generating. Hi guys, let's welcome to what it sounds like. Beauty. So let's watch this I'm video sure guys step by step it. to see how Toyozi um, brought my character to life. I'll like enjoy. To generating, and then I'll click on the download icon down there. So once I download it, to just download into my files, and I'll go back to my um, Canva app. So this is where we stopped earlier. I'll click on the image and click on upload audio. Um, upload your own audio. Yeah. So I already have it downloaded. So it will just upload. I'll just upload it here now. Yes, this is the audio. Now I'm going to scroll down and click on generate presenter. So usually you can see I have one credit left. So depending on the length of your 
audio and your video, you, you're going to pay using a credit. So I think it gives you free credit first. It gives you about 15 free credit. So you can use that up. Hi guys, welcome to Luckily from the Toyo So let's That's watch this video step by step so this is to ready. see how Toyo Z brought my character to life. Sure in Enjoy. Avatar, but this is the avatar and this is how I created it. Now we're just going to pull it to fill in the cam. Uh, Pull it from down to, and um, that's good. And uh, Guys, welcome to see. Truthfully Toyosi. So let's watch this video Click step by step to see how yep, the lips brought are the moving and the life sync. Enjoy with the um, audio file. So what I'm going to do now is I'm just going to save it. Click on share, and then click on the download icon. I'm going to increase the quality to 4K. And then click on download. Yes, so it's downloading. I'm going to wait a few seconds to minutes, depending on the length. And we are good to go. So guys, um, I think we're done here. If you've enjoyed this video, give it a thumbs up.